middle school. And we were probably nervous, excited, and pretty ready to start the next chapter. High school. Some will say it flew by, and some will say they climbed the Mount Everest to get here. But whatever route you took to get here, we're all here. In front of our family. College, joining the military, or the workforce, all of us start a new world today. Uh, I didn't know most of my classmates um, in middle school, but I do feel lucky to have known who they were in high school. I met them through classes, sports, clubs, mutual friends, or maybe even just sitting next to each other in the library on the computers, you know, whatever. Um, but a lot of memories are made here that most of us will always have engraved in the back of our minds, whether we want them or not. Like, like the, the teachers, teachers acting out the 12 days of Christmas at the winter wrap assemblies for whatever reason, or the underdog coming up on top as our senior class president. Sorry, I mean squad leader. <laughs> Learning what it really means to hit someone up in the DMs, or the Pledge of Allegiance being rewritten at Fall Rally 2015. Shout out to Tran. <laughs> Sports games that were so intense that it had everyone at the edge of their seats or discovering the new Snapchat filters. Woo! Alongside plenty of other memories, a lot of us were shaped mentally, physically, spiritually, and emotionally throughout high school. Even if we can't see it, I truly believe it'll be us who will change this world. We will be the ones to push the boundaries to make this world a better place in small and large ways. We were given the tools, the drive, and the courage to do things we never thought we could in high school. And I have no doubt that we have the rest of our lives to surprise ourselves with our own strength. As we go out there to pursue our dreams, I hope we all fail at some point. I hope we all fall off course just long enough for us to get back to where we are supposed to go. I hope we change our minds and then change it again. But most of all, I hope that we learn from the lowest points of our life so as to be ready for the best times of our lives. For though a righteous person falls seven times, they get back up. To my classmates, I would like to say this. You may have not been the person you wanted to be in high school. Maybe you were a jock, a cheerleader, a partier, a nerd, an athlete, a loner, a club president, or even popular. But you still wish you were more than that. Some think that we have one chance to make a statement of who we are in life. But I say we have the rest of our lives to recreate ourselves. You are never, ever too old to set another goal or to dream another dream. In closing, I'd like to read a quote from F. Scott, F. Scott Fitzgerald. Uh, quote, for what it's worth, it's never too late, or in our case, too early, to be whoever you want to be. There's no time limit. Stop whenever you want. You can change or stay the same. There are no rules to this thing. We can make the best or the worst of it. But I hope you make the best of it. And I hope you see things that startle you. I hope you feel things you never felt before. I hope you meet people with a different point of view. I hope you live a life you're proud of. If you find that you're not, I hope you have the strength to start all over again, end quote. Congratulations, class of 2016. We made it. We out of here. Thank God. <laughs>